Bray with Bloody Siege. Um, we have a 1v1 on our hands, and obviously, me being the spectator, we get to watch everything and probably roast. Um, probably won't be a roast, but you know. Um, we're here with like one occasional gaming video. It probably won't be, there probably won't be another one for a while um, because this is just a one off thing. Because I thought it'd be a good idea to see something different on the channel. Well, I mean, everything's different every time, but you know, still. Um, obviously, you know, um, I sadly can't use them a lot, so I can't actually really speak much about it, which I probably best to actually. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly move away from the mod that's recording and actually get my other mod where I can mute it so that I can actually speak to you a lot more. all done now i've all changed so i shall mute this mod now okay so we're here as you can see i do apologize for not moving it that much i'll say we have morgan in the apc area as of currently um, and jay being obviously in them um, master bedroom well the objective being in master bedroom and jay obviously being in kitchen and um, obviously he's trying to peek towards all spawn areas obviously he didn't really double check, obviously, this this one. So obviously, Morgan is Blackbeard, and obviously, Jay's Bandit, which Bandit is quite a unique character. And we'll quickly have a look how... How did he use it? Okay, so he put two on there. Two on there. Did he just only put two? Yes, he only put two. So he hasn't used all of his things, but I suppose he can't use it. He's got to think logistically, so... I would have probably myself put some in this little hallway here. Obviously, I can't mark it, but I would have put some in that hallway myself um, on some of them walls. Obviously, he can easily like peek through right into main room or um, bathroom through that wall. Pardon. Okay, so as of right, oh, as of right now, we have Morgan on the roof. So, I see he looks like he's trying to go through bathroom. Or at least looked like he is, which obviously Jay isn't hearing it by the sound of it. But obviously, I do have Jay and Morgan in through my mic myself, so obviously I can hear their communication. Obviously, I think Morgan might go for the peak. Yep, Morgan's trying for the peak. So they both know where they are as of currently. But now, obviously, Jay moved. Um, obviously, you know, both have moved softly. Oof! Now, obviously, Jay did get hit just then, either through the um, door or through the actual wall itself. But good wall bang from Morgan. Obviously, Morgan only has a minute to try and get in, so obviously he's taking time to actually get into and wipe most floors as far as, like, you know, checking and everything. So now, Jay might go to the engine engineering. I don't know why I call it engineering. I'll just call it this room. Okay, so Morgan might try maybe considering an opening of that window whilst Jay's waiting on that. Okay, Jay's heard him. Jay has heard him. So, see, Jay's not going to push it this time. Or maybe he might try for the... Ooh, ooh. Is that a bait? That was a bait, slightly. But can Jay hear that? Jay can... Okay, Jay might not be able to actually hear him at this point in time. So, I'll see more... Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay, so Morgan has to push now, which Jay's done, and then position himself in the room. So now he's just... Oh, here we go. Oh, absolute brutal, that is. Jay's very... To be honest, Jay's very good with C4. Well, I played with him on C4 for a couple of days. Well, it's actually about a week or two now. He's very good with C4s and positioning. Sometimes he misses, which is understandable, but most of the time they're on target, and they do, in the end, like, you know, kill. So, you know, it's good. Obviously, Morgan is picking Master Bedroom whilst Jay's construction site, which I wouldn't really pick construction site that much. I'd be preferring APC area. But obviously, that's my choice. Now, Morgan is vigil. Well, was vigil until he changed to Ella. Ella's a very good character. But obviously, Doka B. Mm, I don't know about. Well, obviously, he's changed now to Doc. Um, Doka B, though, obviously, he can be helpful. But he really, I'd suggest for Jay, if he's using Doka B, to just be near the room. Then at least he knows if Morgan's in the room or not. So, obviously, you know. 
and now Morgan just said to the mod that he has the wrong operator. So obviously that's not good at all for Morgan. Obviously Jay doesn't actually know who the operator is. So obviously Morgan's been very, you know, tactical as far as like barricading and everything, which is good. But he still missed out key points. Like obviously bedroom would be good, a good one. Instead of just the main room, bed, kids' bedroom, and obviously this place here, because then obviously that would you'd be able to hear him come through. That room he should have really kept open. So obviously, really, um, you know, that place would have been good open place. But okay, he's placing his things as right now. Jay is currently by APC. I think trying to wait. Right. I was going to say he wouldn't be able to long shot. Obviously, this video might be long because obviously I'm going to do the full match. So, hopefully, it doesn't like cut out halfway through. So, Jay's now droning um, on bottom floor and is now going to head up to first floor, which I would have suggested myself. Probably um, throwing it into that balcony, well, little balcony area, then through middle and then onto top. But, you know, as long as he gets there, now Morgan's side side's dead on that thing, so I think he knows he's droning. So, as soon as he comes to that door, Morgan might try and hit him. Okay, at this point in time. Okay, so Jay's all drones are out for Jay, so Jay has no surveillance, barring if he gets access to defend. Well, actually, no, he can't get access to defend the cameras because he has to kill someone. So, Delta B really is just for vibrations, really. Um, so, obviously, I'd suggest Jay to just go into the bathroom. Hopefully not get wall banned by Morgan, which he shouldn't really. And then obviously ring it, because then he'd know that obviously Morgan's in there. I'd say we even ring it now, maybe. There we go, I think he is. Yep, he is as well. So see, so you can hear that. So Jay knows he's in there. So Jay's going to try the push. Okay, Jay's wasting a lot of them. So... I don't know if that was a distraction, but that hasn't worked out, I wouldn't say, myself, because obviously a lot of noise from kids' bedroom. So now he knows that, obviously, he should know that Morgan's still within the room. But now Morgan's going to try for the push. Well, not for the push, for the um, little shot. So, from our perspective, Morgan could get easy shot. So Jay really... Mm, Jay could really be good with, like, proning dead across the w window and then just get better and okay he's gonna die if he doesn't i'm surprised okay i think jay knows where he is yeah there you go good efficiency that is that's always good but then the only thing is as well because now he's open kids always morgan could always open one of his and just bomb round okay he morgan knows morgan knows i think always oh, trying to wall back well tried to wall bang but obviously Morgan has sufficient courage, so Jay now has to push, really. So it's now just really a war. Yeah. So, see, that was good from Morgan's perspective, because obviously he held his position and didn't really do many peaks. Obviously, he did a lot of barricades and stuff. So, all in all, very good round for, obviously, Morgan. So it's as of currently 1-1. One, one. one kill each, obviously, one death each. So... So obviously now Morgan's put APC area, which I've got to admit, I would go there myself. Master bedroom again. So I would have, I would have really swapped out for kids. Or even another, probably the kids would get, well, I would have put kids myself. Because obviously kids are the smallest room, so obviously you don't have to cover, cover that much. But at the same time, with master bedroom, it obviously has that back um, wardrobe. So obviously that's a very, that's very good cover, especially if you know the glitch of obviously getting on top. Which is very open. Oh, okay, so this is good, this is good. Cap can, so you get to see Jay with his favourite character. Obviously, Morden is Ying. Ying, he used to be a very good Ying. Oh, I remember when Morden was Ying back a couple of um, seasons ago. But now, Mord, Mo, this might be sort of a new thing for Jay. Because obviously, you know, I don't think he's ever come up to against a Ying. I don't think. So. But hopefully Jay plays some pos position... Places his positions correctly with hopefully some baits like he might do now actually. Yes, go on. Okay, very good. 
This is good, because really you shouldn't always surround the entire room. I'd suggest at least do like two the two doors. But don't always surround it because you need to put it in place. Like even downstairs, maybe like one of the kitchens. Like this door here, put one there. Because he probably wouldn't expect it. He's probably like too busy thinking of other stuff. But always put them in places where they won't expect it. Obviously, some in the main door, obviously. Okay, with Jay, actually, he hasn't got any reinforcements yet. And it's already started, the game has. So at this point in time, where's Morgan? Okay, so Morgan is there. So he's going to try, I think he's going to try and open up that window there. We might just be waiting. I'd say, though, in this situation, I would put one in that main door, too. Because Morgan can easily war, like, run in at the last second. Which, obviously, would be very helpful for Jay. Because, obviously, it means, like, a proper, like, full-on battle. I don't know what angle that was from then. Oh, see, the thing is, that's so open, so Morgan could literally drone and see that, and then last second just run in. Right. It'd be so, so efficient if so. One thing is a mirror. Like, in this map, especially not the castle or something, mirror's so OP for the master bedroom because this wardrobe here, you can actually explode with them. Um, the grenades and then basically you can open it up and then put a mirror on like the inside of there it's so op it's so good and that's why mirrors are a good one for this map but at the same time clash because you can easily just sit in a corner with a couple of mates and just use as bait and then you know you can be like surveillance okay, so now jay's not actually in the room which is very strange but okay so he's now droning morgan's now droning so obviously morgan's actually seen him only in the room so, he's always going to try for the wall bang, but didn't work. So, Jay knows his position now. So, it's going to be... Um, now, Jay's thinking that, obviously, he's going to go through bottom floor. Which, obviously, Morgan could rush if he... he oh, no, he got rid of his drone, didn't he? That's why I really try to save my drones as best I can for these sort of situations. Okay, so now, Jay's heading back up, but he might rush. Oh, no. He won't rush him, but he'll actually just go and camp in the small room of Master. Now Morgan has 25 seconds and actually yinged himself. So obviously that could have been highly... Um, you know. So could he run in? Oh, no, Jay has a good angle on this. Oh, so okay, so Morgan has half health. He's now trying to rush that way. Okay, yep. Oh. Okay, I don't think... In that situation, I don't think Jay was... Fully awake, if I'd say so myself. But obviously, Morgan was ready. So, obviously, at this point in time, 2 1. So, yes, again, I do apologise if this cuts out at one point. Because it might be because of having so much stuff on my USB. But hopefully, not. Hopefully, I can do the entire thing. I'd love to do the entire thing. Because it's very good. I like my commentary. Because if it's, nothing's distracting me, I can just think. And just talk. But when things are like talking in the background, I just can't. Okay, so Jay is playing Glass, which obviously he could get a re The thing is, though, Morgan last time did reinforce a lot, so obviously, more Jay might not have good angles from obviously balcony onto stairs and all that way. Because obviously, this, this little like tower, Jay could use to like look straight through that window there. Well, this window, small window, straight through to there, but yet again, Obviously, Morgan is lesion, so obviously, if Jay needs to push, he can just literally lesion him, and then... So, obviously, Jay, at this situation, needs to get just proper toxic, just to get Morgan. But I don't think he'd be able to, because Morgan can easily, like, reinforce with Jay. That is actually really efficient from Jay. Obviously, I don't know if you can see that light. That is where Jay is, on that little wardrobe. Which, obviously, I'm glad he's not been able to get rid of that, because now he has two drones. Um, so obviously if one goes, he always has that spare one. Obviously, Jay shouldn't really need to mark me, because, you know, he's obviously a waste of a drone, really, considering it's a 1v1. Okay, so he's now coming from construction site, heading onto ground floor, if I'm correct. Okay, so he's actually looking where Morgan is, because Morgan, for we know, could start roaming. 
but he's actually not. He seems like he's going to camp in that corner. But... Could he? Could he? Ooh. If he made a big enough hole there, it'd be very hard, I know. Like, I'm making it sound like really cool, but... He'd literally make a hole there, then through there, and get him in that corner. But he's actually trying from that angle into there. So... Mondra's literally just easily just stay there. That was a big hint that literally Mondra said he can't. He said that you can't wall bang for that. Okay, nice. Good drone use there. But no, the only problem is it's... Yeah. I would have suggested probably to like move that back or something. Okay, yes, go there. He could easily get into that. Damn. Wow, that is very good. Obviously, um, Jay could have literally, could have gone from the other um, thing and still probably got a good shot at him. At this point in time, I'm hearing over the mod, obviously, you know. Um, Morgan is being called a camp, obviously. You know. But obviously, saying that, you know, I think it's just Jay's annoyed. Which is understandable. I'd be the same. I'd be there getting really annoyed. So, obviously, here we go again. APC area, master bedroom. Hopefully, that stays how it is. But yet again, Jake would always go to construction site. So, three one as of currently. So, well, Jake would easily bring it back, but he's trying to lose concentration slightly, so from the sound of it, and um, because obviously he thinks obviously he's just going to lose anyway. So he's slightly using con like concentration or conversation. Okay, so Morgan now is Jackal as a random operator. He wasn't meant to pick that, but he just forgot about picking it. So, Jay's Bandit as of currently. So, hopefully this round he actually uses all of his ability. Because, you know, he could easily do get them two. And then one of these walls here. Um, Definitely I'd suggest... Oh, no, because he can't actually. Because he's only got... Oh, actually, so... If he'd only... Does he... I can't even see if he has... Actually, maybe I can. Okay, no, he doesn't. He has a nitro cell. And what does Morgan have? Oh, no, I can't even see Morgan yet. Okay. So, I would have suggested, based on because of how many things he has, um, and how many reinforcements he has, obviously, I would have suggested um, if he had barbed wire to use that instead of a nitro cell. I know nitro cell would have been beneficial, but obviously, he would have been able to use his um, barbed wire... And the bandit, because then he could have literally restricted so many drones going into the room from both doors. Which obviously would have been a great help. Because I don't think Morgan's drone was took out. I can't remember. But he obviously he's got that spare drone. And Jay has obviously locked, slightly locked himself out from one door. And Morgan's done a hit from that door. And obviously Jay's going to try. Okay, Jay has run into that room. And he's just constantly got his eyes dead on there. So I think that was really a distraction from Morgan. As he goes right to the spare room, I'm going to call it. I was going to call it engineering room, but... Okay, so he's backing off now. Making noise in kitchen, because obviously that will just alert Jay. And if Jay's got good hearing, he'll hear, obviously, the moving across the roof. The grappling. Especially on this angle, he'll probably hear the grappling. Okay, now is he, is he going to... Oh, okay, this is a odd position. Okay, he's, I think what he's trying to do is get a long shot into the room. But obviously, Jay being in there, he's protected, so... I would say for Morgan myself, um, he's waited there a couple more minutes, seconds, but obviously... Um, okay. So now, because of this angle, he's going to really see where Jay is, because then... Because I think he's got a long... Jay could easily get a long shot from the angle Morgan was at. But at the same time, Morgan could. So hopefully Morgan's drone doesn't get took out. Because if it does, then obviously that means a loss of drone. A loss of drone. But now, as of currently, it hasn't. So that could be used again. Oh, that is a good play. Literally. <coughs> That's exactly... That's literally exactly what I was on about. Obviously, that was a sort of risk. But obviously, it has to be taken. But 
Obviously now it's 3-2. Obviously it's looking good. It's looking good, you know. Could easily turn back to Jay winning this. Which obviously would go in Jay's favour. So. Good plays from both of them, I've got to admit. I've, like, when they watch these videos, they'll see their mistakes. But there's been a lot of good plays and a lot of good uses of their abilities and drones. But key thing is just using the drones in this situation. Because obviously you don't want to just damage both of them and then they're gone. Because that's your only surveillance if you're an attacker. So... Okay, Morgan is Jaeger, and then obviously Thermite. Okay, so Thermite might be efficient. Okay, so Morgan now could literally place him in the most, like, you know, good life from Jay. He literally just said, he literally just said, I'm not being, I wasn't Thermite, even though he is. So that, that's a good way to keep him off, but obviously he's probably already knows. At this point in time, though, based on where Morgan's put the reinforcement, he probably wouldn't be able to get there. By the time, unless, maybe, actually, maybe he might, so, he could go literally, if he stands back, bathroom again, he could literally blow there, which means Morgan's cover behind here is done for, which means Morgan will be pushed over here, which means he could look through there, so that, that's pretty efficient, but it's just how he plays it, so now obviously he's come from APC area, so, obviously, hopefully, he goes straight over to bathroom, really, especially, based on, obviously, you know, but, okay, so Jaeger, being obviously the one who literally counters Fuse most of the time, obviously I think Morgan thinks he actually is Fuse, which obviously is in Jay's favour. So now, Jay's heading to spare room, is it? Is he trying to spare, oh no, he's doing cameras. That's quite efficient saying that, because you could easily just scan someone from the stupidest angles on the camera. Obviously, uh, tomorrow, not tomorrow, Friday will resume of normal suggestions, so, <clears throat> and um, one is one from Dylan, um, he did suggest one a couple of days ago, I think like last week sometimes, but I just haven't got around to doing it, because obviously I've had the Mac, and then I was recommended one today, which is a Wednesday, which is popular MMOs, which I will do that, if there is any others you want me to react to, or you want me to do a video on, please let me know. Okay, so, ooh, is Jay trying? Okay, Jay's doing there. Okay, I wouldn't have suggested that particular part of the wall, because I would have moved it over just for that door. Because now he might not be able to have a good angle. Oh, maybe he does, actually. That's not a bad of an angle, but Morgan can easily get a shot to him. Yeah, Morgan's easily got a shot. So, as I suggested before, I would have suggested to go through there. Because he could have blown that out, which means Morgan's done for. Oh, Oh, but he's getting a good play. He, get, he did get a good play on him, but Morgan's staying in that position. Okay, with one minute left, I would have literally just gone to bathroom, blown that out. Look, here we go, go on. Think, look at that. I do apologise for that. Um, at this point in time, I'm going to quickly just turn myself, do not disturb. Just for the fact I'm doing the video, and I don't want to be disturbed by Chloe inviting me. Which I will invite her, probably, when I get off the video. So, unless she's playing with someone. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay, that's probably not a place I would have suggested. But yet again, I didn't actually notice. Morden has been, like, barricaded there. Oh, oh. So, there you go. 4-2. I don't know if Morden's fully won that. But, you know. I don't know if Morden's fully won that. But. Obviously. Is that it? Oh, there you go. So, see, so that's the end of the game. I hope you enjoyed my commentary. I thought it was very good myself. But anyway, hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Just like, comment, and subscribe for more weekly content. So, yeah, okay, I was with them. Bye.